Sleeping like a baby. It's something many of us dream of, but don't always get. Rosemary Piper used to snore so loud, it would disrupt everyone around her. I'd go up north visiting, and everybody would leave the bedroom. I'd find them in the cellar sleeping. I really must have been loud. <laughs> but a new study finds snoring is more than fodder for bad jokes. It might also play a role in heart disease. Up to now, snoring alone wasn't really taken into consideration. Researchers from Harvard University and Brigham and Women's Hospital found women who snore regularly have a 33% higher risk of developing heart disease. Women who occasionally snore have a 20% higher risk than non-snorers. One of the uh, hypotheses is that snorers may have a higher instance of sleep apnea. It was right here. Snoring is caused by a vibration to the extra tissue on the back of the throat. Sleep apnea, however, is a stoppage of breathing for several seconds at a time. When we stop breathing, uh, there is no oxygen getting to our brain, getting to our heart. Sarasota Memorial Sleep Disorder Clinic Director Dr. Glenn Adams calls it the nighttime strangler. There's probably about 38,000 deaths every year uh, that occur because of sleep apnea during the night. One in 20 adults who snores will develop sleep apnea. Rosemary is one of them. Now she wears an airway pressure device at night to regulate her breathing. Now I don't bother anybody. Before, they, they'd have to shut doors. Now, a few of her fears about heart disease can be put to rest. This is Todd Callis reporting.